Welcome and welcome back to Scorpio Tiger's Tarot. I'm Scorpio Tiger. I am here to do um, a what do you need to know reading for you guys. Okay, I hope everyone's week is going great. Let's get into this. This is a general reading, so take what resonates. Leave the rest. You already know what to do. If love shows up, reverse rolls as needed. What does Aries need to know, Spirit? Oh, your overall energy is the Ace of Wands. Everything you wish for, honey. Good stuff. Good stuff, Aries. Let's get some energy to show Aries collective. Thank you. We got the Eight of Wands, the Tower, okay, you're going to receive some news that's going to cause some big changes in your life. Do I take that, Spirit? Okay. Eight of, eight of Swords, okay. It might be, it's going to cause you some anxiety, Aries, and the Four of Pentacles, Okay. Maybe telling you to save some money right now, okay? At the bottom of the deck, we got the nine of pentacles. So, yeah, you're, you're going to be uh, looking good, feeling good, smelling good. Everything's going to be fruitful for you. Let's clarify. The eight of wands. Why is this here for the Aries Collective? Why is the eight of wands here? Oh, let's get some more. Further clarify this. We got the Hierophant in reverse. Hold on a second. Thank you. The Hierophant in reverse. The Seven of Wands, the King of Swords, and the Wheel of Fortune. Okay. I got to look at that Hierophant in reverse. Hold on a second. And that Taurus energy. Okay. Guilt and shame, conflict with someone in authority. And as far as love, you and your partner aren't on the same page and compromise is needed. That's what it looks like. It looks like you and your partner is not on the same page, so they're coming in to communicate. You guys are going to communicate, and you are going to make it clear to them that um, you want to be single. Is what it looks like. You don't want to be. You don't want to be linked up right now. You don't want to be in a relationship. You want to be free. Yeah, you want to put it behind you too, and it's all in divine timing. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Spirit. The, to the tower. Why is this car here? The Scorpio energy. Oh, that's the tower here. <laughs> we got the Knight of Pentacles, the Six of Swords, the Sun, the Knight of Wands, the Emperor, and the Star. Why so many cars, Spirit? All right. After you had this communication with this person, it looks like it's going to be some big change that's going to happen for you. And it's going to come in slow, but it's going to move you to a better place in your life, okay? The, the process of being single, you know, because this could be a breakup. Um, the process of it all is, is going, to, going to happen real slow. You're healing and moving forward, but you're going to get your happiness, okay? And you're going to go finish what it is you started. Okay. Or maybe you're going to get a brand new relationship. It looks like you're just really keeping to yourself, Aries. And you're going to and and you're going to do your healing. Okay? So that's what that change is 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 talking about. You healing from this relationship. It looks like it's here. Okay? And you're going to be just fine. You're going to put it all behind you and you're going to move forward. Okay, good stuff. The 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 eight of swords. Why is this here for Aries collective? Spirit. Thank you, Spirit. Let's clarify that eight of swords. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah.
Okay. You're going to feel bound. Um, like you don't know what you want, what, what to do. But you're being told to move forward from this relationship. Because you look, I'm, I'm, I'm seeing and feeling confusion here. You don't know what you're going to do. And you're doing some research areas or something. You might be on online dating or something. And you're trying to move forward. You might be trying to move away. So you can get out the city that this person lives in. That's what it looks like. Yeah. You need to do some research. That's what it looks like. Further clarify the Eight of Swords, please. Let's further clarify that. That Eight of Swords. Further clarify that spirit. Thank you. Yeah. Do some more research and focus on your money. Okay? With that page of pentacles. Okay? Yeah. Because your money a little funny. But you're going to get your wish. You're going to get what you're looking for. Okay? The the fourth pentacle. Why is this here for the Aries Collective? So somebody's moving on from a relationship. They're going to, you guys are going to communicate. And you're going to just decide to stay single. Yeah. You're being told to save your money and guard yourself. You're going to have to be strong. When dealing with this person, there, there goes that six of wands again. Yeah. You're, you're going to move on to success. Yeah. And that is your overall energy, Aries. You got the ace of wands. Anything you ask for, anything you wish for, you're going to get it. Good stuff. Anything else? Yeah. Focus on your own work because you're popular. Okay. People admire you. Absolutely wonderful. It's time to go down a brand new path with that Pisces energy. Yeah. You don't even know that you're popular. You probably don't even know that. But people are watching you, Aries. Mm -hmm. Good stuff. Yeah. And you're going to get your contentment in all areas of your life. You're going to be just fine after this heartbreak. Yeah. Can't make it. Any message for the Aries Collective Spirit? <sighs> yeah, too much drama. And, and somebody's saying it's too much drama and they need space. And it looks like it's you telling them that. And then it says this uh, next level commitment is coming towards you. That's absolutely beautiful. Next, Because we got engagement and marriage. It's too much drama. They, they, it's chaotic uh, energy at play. Okay? And I need space. Take the time to think and gain clarity. Okay? Ask your question, Aries. Any answers for Aries collector? Any answers for Aries collector? This energy and this reading spirit. Listen to your intuition. It'll never fail you. That's your ancestors talking to you. That's your spidey senses. <laughs> Listen to your intuition. If you took anything from this reading here, it's like, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys soon. Have a great evening.